Moo! Welcome, everybody, to Fable 2, part number 29. In the last part, we got back from a 10-year journey to the Spire, where we rescued Garth. And I've changed back into some appropriate clothing, a nice jacket, my wizard's hat back on, got my best sword out, my best gun out, I'm all set up. And we're returning home for the first time in 10 years. Wonder what my child's gonna be like. Wonder if my wife's gonna be okay with this. Hmm. Oh, you're back! I thought you were dead. Uh, I missed you so much. I've got someone very important for you to meet. Say hello to your son. Are you my dad? It's very nice to meet you. Mom says you're a hero. Is it true? When I grow up, I'm going to be a hero too. You'll get tired of hearing that. He says it all the time. To everyone. Are you going to stay with us, Dad? Yes, darling. Stay with us a while. Don't leave us again so soon. Hello. It's about you time you me? came home again. Well, we named him Clug for some weird reason in the dialogue. It Hello. said Brian still, which kind of sucks. Damn fable glitches. But anyways, that was a very warm greeting I can't play here for our family. I There's my grown-up son and my wife, who doesn't seem upset at all. I want to get close to you. Really close. Really now? Well, that's just great, but... You know, if I was gone for ten years, I think this is how my wife would sound if I showed up after all this time. Well, well, look who it is. It's my good-for-nothing husband. Well, you go out and adventure and have good old times killing things and collecting treasure. I'm here by myself raising our kid. Little oh, brat he is, too. He's just like you. Where have you where the hell have you been for ten years? And you've been so busy you can't even come home and visit? Moo okay, so I'm back. And uh thanks to Zelos there for providing the voice of what I think the wife should have said. Now did I get everything from in here? I think I did, right? I got everything from in here ten years ago, right? Oh yeah, definitely. Where's my little clugger? Hey, little clugger. How you doing? Anyways, let's go greet the wife properly. I'm sorry, sweetheart. You're sorry? Hmm. I'm sorry, too. Let's give you a present. Let's give you a gift. I haven't gone for ten years. What's a good one here? Um, how about some chocolate? You want some chocolate? How about some chocolate? Oh, you're so sweet. Dear. I know. I, you do all sorts of cool stuff. I know, I'm the Come best. Let's, Go on. Let's get you to follow me now. Okay, lead the way. Lead the way. I know where we're going. Come on, baby. Let's. The kid can watch, right? Come on, let's go. Up the stairs. Up the stairs. Hey, now. No, no, we don't want to rest right now. Come on, baby. We want to do it. Let's... Okay, we got her following. No, see, it's still saying rest. That sucks. So, have you ever been to the cities under the sea? Under the there sea? Are no. There cities under the sea, right? No, there's no cities under the sea. At least not that I know of. <laughs> this is why our marriage works. I know, our marriage works great. I'm trying to get her horny right now. For my expert, just smashing. It is. For my expertise, it usually doesn't take long. That's just wonderful, my love. I know. It's amazing. Maybe it's because the kids around, I don't know. I love it. Oh, accept the gift. We're getting another gift. Yes, forty seven gold. This place sucks. Let's go somewhere fun. Oh that's, that's nice, darling. <laughs> That's all you got? Is 47 gold after 10 years to give me? Seriously? Oh, 
wonderful, sweetheart. You would think you would have more gold than that. Can we do it yet? Can can we can we go to the bed and do it? No, wow. we can't do it. Ooh, you're such a charmer. I know. I know. I'm trying. Moo K, okay. so after trying for a while, she just She just won't go back to bed with me. I've been trying to seduce her and she just won't go to bed with me. So goodbye, little clugger. I got more adventures to go on. I got lots of things to do here, you know. And um, I better release her from her. No, no, no. I said release her from her. I love it. Wait. Wait. I said wait. Stop. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye, clugger. Really is confusing. What's confusing? I gotta go. I got, you know, take care of the kids some more. I got places to go. I got people to save. You know, all that kind of stuff. Goodbye, kid. Hmm. Maybe I'll bring you back a broadsword. We'll see. Hey, boy! You want me to scratch you behind the ear? Anyway, it's time for another adventure. Um. We're going to head back up to the Temple of Light. I believe the people there that we have saved a couple times now from evil might be, you know, there might be some more adventures going on up there. So let's, I'll meet you up at the Temple of Light. Moo. Moo. Okay, so I'm back. We're heading up here to the Temple of Light. and I got my golden trail set for this next quest. As you can see. The temple has prospered greatly during your absence. Without your help, this place would be deserted and its people dead or scattered. Hmm. Well, I'm I'm so glad I was able to help, you know, and that the temple is able to have thrived. Wow. I think it's been built up nice, and it's a nice little place here. We got some water. Is this water always here? I can't remember. Is there a place to uh? Search for stuff here? No, I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't have been in the water. Somebody's talking around here. I think there's an upstairs now. And I don't think that other building was here the whole time, to be honest with you. But then again, I I didn't really pay attention to the uh to the layout of this place. Like I don't know what this upstairs is for. It doesn't really get you anywhere. It's just a nice little lookout. I guess you can dive. Whee! <laughs> Wonder what's in this other building. Oh, I can purchase this other building. Apparently, there's a deed for it. What is this? Oh, I can purchase a whole temple of light for ninety-two thousand dollars. <laughs> Which you have to do if you want to buy everything. What do we got in here? Nice fountain. Got some. Uh, nobody's really in here. Just some statues. Let's go see what the quest is all about then. Oh, hold it. It's not even there. It's all, like around the corner. Who's in here? Ah, welcome, my good friend. Please contribute to our temple and receive the blessing of the light. I've. Each donation will bring you wisdom and peace of mind. That's just great. I've kind of already brought some money to the do. Yeah. I don't need to donate anymore unless I want to be good more, which I might have to later on. Might cost me a lot of money because I'm going to have to be some evil at one point in this game. Yeah, so we might have to pay a lot of money. I mean, a lot of money to get my goodness back. But let's talk to this guy over here. Hey! You look like the sort of goes into caves, dungeons, and uh, whatnot when people ask them to. Uh, you can help me. Yeah, it's my digs, you see. I, yeah, I live in this cozy little cavern, hardly any dampness at all. But I've been kicked out by a family of hobs. See, I came to the temple for shelter. But if you can kick those creatures out of my cave, well, I can go home. Uh, is he in a dress? Okay. Um, we have a cross-dresser here in the land of Alpin. Let's go get the cross-dresser's home back. So, he lived in a cave, and um, some hobs are in it now.
So you're not afraid of a few little hobs, surely? No, I'm not. Ah, that's brilliant! Yeah, in you go then. All right, let's go to the cave. Follow, follow the light. We're gonna take out the hobs so the nice cross-dressing man can go home. It's like, you know. I don't know. He just comes across as not like one of those natural people that just, you know, enjoys being a woman. He comes across as one of those, I've drank a little too much and now I'm a little crazy kind of cross-dressing people. <laughs> he, he might be a little drunk. What the hell? The beetles? Seriously? But yet again, I got my sword and um, taking out these beetles will bring us big bucks and big money. Money, 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 money. Of course, we're still trying to earn all our experience back as we got it thrust away from us on that spire. Where the hell is this cave? This cave is farther than I thought. I don't remember a cave back in town. Hold it. Okay, it's still this way. Golden Trail kind of disappeared there for a little bit. Where is this cave? It's this way? Is the cave even in town? Do I have to leave to like Little Rook Ridge or something? Following the golden trail. Where's the cave now? Oh. There it is. It's this way. Follow the golden road. Okay, it's this way now. Is the tr is is the cave out of, out of town? Out of the t Oh no. Hold it. Wow. Okay. We have a bunch of hobs just standing right here. Wow. Okay. This is bad. They were just kind of standing here. Alright, let's get some fire going. Yes. Level 3 fire. Level 3 fire. Level 3 fire. Yes. But nothing. I didn't do nothing. I was trying to do something. It didn't do everything I wanted it to do. Be all you can be. This is a lot. These are a lot of freaking hobs here. There's a lot of freaking hobs. Shoot the kill, I'll ask questions later. Come on, doggy. Help me out. Yes, knock him down. Lay him down and whack him, hack him. Really, I'm still on that? Seriously? Where'd that other hob go? Did he run away? Do you want? You cannot run away. He's trying to run away, look at him. He's like making all these grunting sounds and... Is he dead now? Is he playing? No, he's playing dead. He can't play dead. Ha! <laughs> uh, treasure? Where? Where? Where's the treasure, Doug? Lead me. Lead me to the treasure, because it's kind of dark and I don't see it. I had no idea that- Oh my god, it's right there in these bushes. I had no idea there was treasure here. Thank you, Doggy, for showing me the treasure. Because I would never have known. 500 gold. Oh, big man! Big man's got the gold! Oh, yeah! That wasn't even in the cave yet, was it? No? The Echo Mine. Echo Beach far away, oh, Echo Beach far away, oh, Echo Beach far away. Echo Mine, not Echo Beach. Whatever. We didn't. We didn't even take out the hobs inside the cave yet. Just the ones guarding on the outside. Kill all the hobs in the cavern. What? Who said that? Was he here? Is the crossdresser here, like watching? I have to take out all the hobs. These magic hobs are like the worst ones. Like you gotta, you gotta go after those ones. Slash! Look at him run! Look at that hob run! All right, so there's ten hobs remaining. Is he? I thought I heard him. He said it would be a great success. What do we got here? The cave diary. This appears to be a page from the makeshift diary. 
I managed to escape that horrible place. The men with the strange masks wanted to sacrifice me. I don't think my family made it. I'll hide out in this cave until it's safe to leave. I hear strange noises come f further inside. Ooh, that sounds scary. Um, okay. He's definitely laughing in here. Laughing. Thinks it's funny. Oh, is this... Like, what is this? Like, why is, why is that glowing right here? Why is this hob glowing? Oh, is he not dead? I'm still stabbing him. Okay. Well, maybe he's dead. What do we got? We got a, we got a dig spot? Oh, we got a silver key, too! Sweet! Not that we really need it, but... I love collecting those silver keys. Dig. Dig a hole. Dig, 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 that hole. Dig a hole. Dig a hole. Twenty dollars. Twenty dollars. Dig, 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 dig. Dig, 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 dig. Money bag. Three hundred bucks just buried in the sand. It's all good. Alright. Um, these hobs are just standing here. Shoot the kill. Shoot the kill, ask questions later. They've like set up a makeshift laboratory or something here. Oh yeah, slay him down and whack him back. Oh, they ran away? They ran away like cowards? Let's see if we can shoot my fire into them. How's that make you feel? Roasted hob on a stick. Five hobs remain. Only five Hobbs remain. Where are you, Hobbs? You can't hide from me. I see more. Boom. He's still walking away from me, though. Pump him full of lead. Shoot the magic man. Oh shit, he's trying to use his magical powers on me. Gotta get that magic guy. See him holding the magic scepter? Take him out. Those guys are the worst. You don't want no part of them. How many are left now? I think I killed three more, right? Oh, dig spot. Sweet. Dig, 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 dig. Where? Where, doggy? Where, where exactly do I dig? Tell me. Right here? Okay. We'll dig. We gotta kill the hob leader. Who is the leader? The leader of the pack. Vroom, vroom. Leader of the pack. Searching for him. You know what? Maybe we should potion it up first. Potion that up right now. And then, holy shit. Who's this guy? Oh my god. He's like summoning other dudes. Keep just attacking. I don't know who else is there. Is he still alive? Treasure? Where? Where? Where's the treasure, doggy? Is it that treasure over there? Because I saw that one. Unless there's another one. I can now forward brutal styles and force push. I gotta love that. What do we got here? Wow, cave diary part 5. I missed four other parts of the cave diary. It consists of most, mostly crude drawings. You can only make it the last part. I found a lovely, lovely corset on our last raid. Bit tight, but it goes great with the skirt I stole off the clothesline last week. Yeah, it looks like he's gone crazy being a crossdresser, and this is his diary. Wow, this human stuff is beneath me. He's definitely gone insane. Wow. So what's in the treasure chest then? And where's our crossdressing crazy dude? We get a concentrated will potion. Gotta love that. I can now afford time control. I love to control time. Time will give you time. Alright, well, let's go find our cross dressing friend. Because we gotta go tell him that, you know, I've cleared his hob cave out. His cave is good to go. You know, you can live here now. It's a pretty big cave for one crossdresser, but whatever. Hello, anybody here? F 
follow the golden road. You were meant to get in, but you killed them. Murderer. Uh oh. I think he wanted me to die. He's not too pleased. We got. Wow, he died pretty easily from a couple slashes of a gun. Tommy's key cavern. So now we got the key to leave this horrible place as we just killed this cross dressing dude. You know, I, I, it was in self defense. He, he did pull his sword on me, so. Basically, the whole mission was a setup. It was a big setup to try to, you know, get us to die. But we don't die. We are smart. Well, I don't, I don't know what's smart, but we are powerful. So let's head back to Oakfield. Oakfield, where the oak trees grow. You are now famous enough to use the scary laugh expression. Yay, I'm more famous. I can now use a scary laugh. We're going to be laughing in a scary manner. Oh boy. Look at all these people that love me now for killing the Hobbs and... Um, because I'm kind of married. That's why. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. I, I do my best around here, you know? I try my best. I do my best. I saved the world from some more hobs. Kick the chicken. And, um, uh, you know, that's, that's what we do around here. Maybe I can buy some more property while I'm around here, you know? Is that an outhouse? You doesn't really have a door on it if it's an outhouse. Do I own this house already? Probably not. So how much does this house cost me? 6930 I got that money. We're going to buy it and rent it out. Just because I want more monies. This property is now mine. Gotta love that money. Gotta love that money. And as you can tell, some of these houses were built after the 10 year period. So, you know, things have grown around here. Things have grown around the land of Oakvale. But in the next episode, we will go and check out Westcliff. Do you remember we were told about Westcliff and how if we invested in that guy's amusement park idea? So we'll go see if maybe that idea came to fruition? Maybe not. I, I don't know. We'll have to find that out next time. Till then, everybody, I've been Cal's Crazy. Please subscribe. Please leave a comment below. And of course, moo!